In this video, we give you a brief overview of hardware and software. So everything that makes up a computer system falls into one of two very broad categories. We have hardware and software. Hardware is all the physical parts of a computer system and its related devices, both internal or external. So we're talking things like motherboards, hard drives and RAM, as well as things like monitors, keyboard, mice and printers. Software is a very general term that covers all computer programs. Again, most software falls into broad categories, such as application, system or utility software. So as we've just said, a computer system is made up of both hardware and software. Software can be further broken down into system software and application software. And system software can be broken down one more step into operating systems and utility software. We're going to be looking at this in more details in a later video. But briefly, just as an overview, operating systems are things such as Windows, Linux, iOS or Android. Utility software are things like antivirus programs, defragmentation, programs that do backup, compression and firewalls. And application software is really everything else. It covers a really broad range of software, from presentation to word processors, through to web browsers, communications, games, multimedia, and much, much more. It's important to understand the relationship between application software, the operating system, and hardware. So if we start at the top of this diagram in the middle, we can see that application software talks to the operating system. The operating system is then responsible for interacting with the hardware, which in turn sends messages back to the operating system, which finally talks back to the application software. In essence, you can see from the diagram on the right that the operating system is between the application software and the hardware. You don't buy a computer game and install it directly on the hardware. You install it on the operating system. To further extend this diagram, you can think of yourself as the user at being at the top of this stack. You interact directly with application software. This talks to your operating system and then to your hardware. Messages get passed back up to the operating system and the application software, and then you see the end result in the form of updates on your monitor or output through your speakers. So let's just recap what we've covered in this introduction. All computer systems comprise of both hardware and software. Software falls into two broad categories, system software and application software. System software was broken down into two further categories, operating systems and utility software. Application software runs on operating system software, and it's the operating system itself that talks to your hardware and application and provides the interface between the two.